Hey friends, let's do Wild Child Guitar Lesson by Wasp. I'll talk you slowly through all the guitar parts and do the solo at the end, all with on-screen tab to make it easy to follow along. And we're tuned to E flat. So let's make a start, I'll play the intro, then we'll break it down. Z. Start on the B string 7th fret, go to G6, B7, G6, then go back to 5 on the B, 6 on the G, B5, 7, G6, then go back to the B, do 7 two times, and then 6 G, 5 B, 6 G, 5 B, back to 6 G, and we do that 10 times there, so slowly. And that's guitar one, and just plays that through. 10 times there, then we have guitar two, and that's just holding pair of chords. We have the F sharp. Then come to a D over A, so open A string, open D string, second fret on the G, second fret on the B, hold that there. B PL chord, back to the F sharp, repeat that again, F sharp, to the D over A, to the B, to the F sharp, then to finish that off we're just going to play A and E, and that's the intro there, then we have our verse, let me play that for you then we'll break it down. Very similar to the intro of the guitar too. We're just playing the F again, or F sharp, sorry. With a D over A. Then we're playing the B minor. Then we're going to pick second fret E, third fret on the B, fourth fret on the G, fourth on the D. So just a back to the F sharp. And then D E. Then repeat that again back to the F sharp. D over A, the B minor, the F sharp, and then just our D, D again there, and that's our first. That's pretty easy. Then we have our pre chorus, let me play that for you. Starting with the D power chord, come up to the E power chord, back to the F sharp power chord. Then we do the D again, the E. Now this come up to the C sharp, we're just going to do a build up palm muting, so we play one and two and three and four and, and on that last and, the second guitar does this little run down two on the D. A, five, four, two to E, five, four, open. And that's our pre chorus here. Then we have our chorus, let's play that. start on the F sharp, play it once, then play it another two times, then we're going to play the open E, hammer onto the second fret, and then just play the open A, so we have, then do that again, the F sharp, E hammer onto two, now play the A power chord, then play the D power chord, and the E power chord. 
do that four times and then we just finish on the F sharp and we hold that for four bars. And there's a little solo over that and we'll do all the solos at the end. And that's our chorus there. From there we go back to our verse, back to our pre-chorus and then back to our chorus. Now for this next chorus, the last F sharp, we're not holding for four bars, just hold that for two bars there. Then we go into our bridge. Now this is pretty easy. We just have A, hold that for two bars. F sharp. Then do that again. A and F sharp there. And that's our bridge. Then after the bridge we have our solo and as I said we'll do all the solos at the end. This is pretty easy again. We just have the A, hold for two bars. The B power chord. Hold for two bars, then do the D for one bar, E for one bar, and back to F sharp for two bars. Then once we've played it through two times, we're going to end on this F sharp coming up the next, so we have 9, 11, and 11, and just slide back once you play it. Then we have this little part here, we're just going to play the D with the volume off and turn your volume up. Slide up to E. Do a big slide and just play the second fret on the E string there. Do that two times. Now just play the two again, hold for four bars. The two again, hold for four bars. Two again, hold for two bars. Then just play D, E. Then we go back to the chorus and we just repeat that till the end. Now let's do the solos. Play that first solo for you. So we just have a bend on the 4th fret G, 2nd fret G, go to the D, 4th fret, back to the G, 4, 2, 4, then do a bend and release, pull off to 2 on the 4, pull off to 2, and then back to the 4 and the D. main solo, let me play that for you. So we're going to start with a bend on the 4th fret on the G, then do it again with lots of vibrato. Then just do a bend, release, pull off the 2, then play 5 on the B. Then we're going to do this little legato bit, so we'll hammer on some pull offs. B string, 2, 3, 5, 3, 2, to the G string, 4, 2, 1, 2. Then come up to the D string, play 9, G and B, 7, back to D9, 7G, D9, 7G, so. Stay on the D, we have 9, 11, 12, G, 9, 11, B, 9, 10, 12, 12. So this next part's gonna be all legato, we're gonna start on the 12th foot on the B, Pull off to 10, pull off to 9, hammer on to 10, hammer on to 12, pull off to 10, pull off to 9. Come to the G string, we have 11, pull off to 7, hammer on to 9, 11, pull off to 9, 7, slide back to 6, hammer on to 9, pull off to 6, 7, 9, 7, 6, slide back to 4, hammer on to 7, 4, 6, 7, 6, 4, and then to finish that off, 7 on the D, 4, 6, 7, 6, 4 there. Finish on that 4 and then slide it up and slide back again. Then jump to the A string, we're going to have 9, 11, 12, D, 11, G, 11, B, 9, 10. Do a bend on 10, bend and release, pull off to 9. And then just play 10. Then come up to the D string, 16, G, 13, 14, B, 
E14, then go 16, 17, do a bend and release on 17, pull off to 16, play 17, then just play 17 again on the E, three bends on 19 on the E, then come up to 22 on the E, three bends there, and then to finish that first part of the solo off, bend on 19, Release 17, 19 B, back to E, 19, 17, 19, back on the B there, and then just 19, slide back. Then we have this next part, let me play that for you. Go through that and there's a harmony on this, it just plays that through twice and we'll look at the harmony as well. So we have 9 on the A, D, 6, 7, 9, 7, 6, 7, 6, back to A, 7, 5, then do a bend on the 7 on the A and release it, then back to 9 on the A, D, 6, 7, 9, 7, 9, Go to G6, back to D9, back to G6, slide up to 7, and then just do a bend on the 9th for a G bend and release. And we do that through two times, and the harmony is going to be doing the same thing. We're going to have the 11th fret on the G, B, 9, 10, 12, 10, 9, 10, 9, jump to 9 on the G, 7 on the G, and then just do a bend on the 9th fret. Then 11 G. B, 9, 10, 12, 10, 12, to E, 9, back to B, 12, E, 9, 10, and then just do a bend on 12 there, bend and release. And that's a harmony there, so let me play that for you. that second solo then we have the last solo so we play that for you so this time we're going to do bend on 17 do another bend then do a tone and a half bend then just play 14 B 14 G do a bend on 17 on the E, play 17, then do two more bends on 17 E. Then we're going to do a run down which is similar to what we did in the main solo. We're going to have the E, 12, 9, 10, 12, 10, 9, jump to the B string, 12, 9, 10, 12, 10, 9, the G string, 11, 7, 9, 11, 9, 7, do the same again, 11, 7, 9, 11, 7, 9, and then A string, same again, 11, 7, 9, 11, 9, back to 7, slide back to 2, and we're on to 5, 2, 4, 5, 4, 2, and then just finish on the third fret on the G there, so slowly. So thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed Wild Child Guitar Lesson. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell and I'll see you soon.